Sorry, Delano, Tavion, and Charles. Tavion, um, so many great things today, but, but what I saw from my vantage point, you were looking at the stat sheet, it truly looked like a team win. So many people contributed. Do you feel that way? Uh, for sure. Um, everybody can contributed. Uh, everybody sat down on their man. Like Coach said, um, our defense created our offense, so uh, we did what we needed to do. Charles, how do you think you all played against Hap today? I mean, I think we played pretty good in the staff. Playing, um, <laughs> playing the one-on-one -on -one game, it was a pretty good game. So, I mean, coaches told me just play good defense and they know we don't pick up good fouls and stuff like that. So, I mean, we did double in one time, so they made it shut, so we went back to playing man. So, we did pretty good job, so. And then offensively, it seemed like every time you got the ball, you were able to make something happen. How much of a rhythm were you feeling today offensively? Yeah, it was, it was good because we shared the ball a lot today in Stan. So, I mean, I've been a good point guard on this team that can actually do well in Stan. That was great. So, I mean, we did, we did a good job today. So, we just come and play. We played um, we play good and we just play, play with some good effort. Tavion, so. um, I think it was Josh's second dunk in the second half. I'm asking you this because you were here last year. Is this, is this as loud, that second dunk, as this arena has been since you've been here? Uh, definitely. It, it was real loud. I mean, my ears was ringing at one point. I couldn't hear anything at one point. So, yeah, it was, it was the loudest. Go on, I'm kind of on that. How, how great was the crowd today? Um, I mean, I'm a freshman, so I haven't seen, I haven't been here a long time, but, like, that was, it was, best I've seen so far and like we need that every time to help us play with the energy we played with in order to win big games like we did. So I know you realize you were as close to a triple double as you ended up? <laughs> yeah, they made it known in the locker room. <laughs> but if you're in the game you didn't you didn't know or no nah, one I'm just I was playing trying to go with the flow of the game. He lying. <laughs> <laughs> Savion, you know that good teams like Wisconsin, they capitalize off any miscue you possibly have. So how, is import, how important is it for you guys to shoot as well as you did in the second half to keep them from being able to take advantage? Um, you know, I feel like we had to shoot it pretty good. Um, we moved the ball as usual now. It's a usual thing. But, um, you know, like I said earlier, we let our defense create the offense. We was getting stops. You know, we was guarding their best players how they need to be guarded, and they created offense for us. David, what does a win like this do for your team's confidence moving forward, starting confidence? Uh, you know, I don't even know what to say. It, it boosts us a lot. You know, it's exciting to play like that. Um, you know, our team's finally coming together, and uh, when we play like that, it's exciting. Kevin, you said you guarded their best players the way you needed to. What do you think the key was for Charles against Hal? Of course, he did so many bad shots. Uh, stay in front of him and don't foul, you know. He can back him down or try to back him down as much as he wants to. As long as Charles is there, I knew he's going to either block it or he was going to have a good contest. Charles, as a team, do you think that today is the best you've played this season from start to finish? And if the answer is yes, why? Uh, I mean, I won't say you know, we, we just by every game we play, we, we take the game serious and it's time we come out, we give our best every game. So, I mean, with the kind of crowd we here today, the atmosphere was great, giving us some good energy. So we just come on and just put some good effort, first four minutes, first half, second half. So we did a good job um, guarding the, um, the players on the other team. And it was a good win for us. So we're just going to take this to the next game and just keep on going. Well, Lana, with, with as much size as Wisconsin has, how important was your all's rebounding today? Um, well, we tried, before even going into the game, we talk about winning the, the rebounding war. So if you win that war, then you know, like, you're going to have a good chance because you're getting more possessions. So that's what we try to focus on going into every game and be able to pull it through tonight. Anything else for these guys? Can I ask one more thing? Delano, um, I can see your confidence growing by leaps and bounds. Do you feel more confident in your play? With each yeah, definitely, definitely. Game? Knowing that I have the trust of my teammates to make plays and do things. So that's really helpful, knowing that I have the trust from them. And for them to trust me to make plays and stuff like that, and I put my trust into them to make shots and, and keep boosting me up and keep me going. So it's good. Hey, Bill, what you think about the, uh, the boost that Jake gave you off the bench tonight? He gave us a big boost after that three, you know. He had me hyped. Uh, definitely when he blocked, dude. Who did he block? Brad Davis. Yeah. <laughs> That had me turned. So, you know, <laughs> he gave us a big boost. We needed him. He, 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 you know, he's a good player.
know, he capitalized. I know I asked you about it yesterday, but does this feel a little bit sweeter just with how last year's game ended and then to, to get your all's revenge today? Definitely. You know, um, when everybody here in Bowling Green thought about Wisconsin, they thought about that one play. So now we finally got our chance to play them again and look at the results. Thank you, guys.